hey, it's me, Vince G. Dr. Layden called me that a couple weeks ago online, and I'm kind of running with it. So, um, first of all, I want to thank everyone who uh, supported me during the launch of my show, because I wouldn't have been a mild success without you guys. I especially want to thank Lori and Michael from the Vices and Terramo podcast. They've been really supportive for months and months now, and uh, I really appreciate it. So, this is going to be an update on what's currently going on with the show and what I want to do with the show in the future. Some, some little ideas I'm kicking around. Okay, I'm doing, basically, I'm calling them seasons. I'm doing blocks of episodes, about six at a time. I'm filming them. And so, uh, season one, uh, episode one, is The Screaming Skull. I have a board over there with notes written on it so I don't forget what I want to say. Episode 2 is The Beast of Yucca Flats. Episode 3, Missile to the Moon. Episode 4, The Indestructible Man. Episode 5, Jesse James Meets Frankenstein's Daughter. And Episode 6, Horror Express. Horror. Horror Express. Yes. So, um, now the first season I've been a bit sluggish and monotone in my delivery because I've been shooting this late at night to help better control the lighting and also I've been under a lot of stress lately and so I've been very flatlined when I've been doing the host segments. Uh, also you're going to notice I do a lot of blinking because I'm having issues with the air conditioning right now and I'm doing a lot of this so hopefully that won't be continuing in the future. Now. Uh, season two, I plan on introducing the Vlad character. You saw him in the, the promo. Hopefully you saw the promo. I put a lot of work into that stupid thing. And I'm hoping to incorporate him into season two, but it's going to be really tricky because I have to do a, a lot of green screening with that character, and I'm, I'm really not sure how I'm going to pull that off. Now, uh, Fido, I'm not too sure what to do with him. I've kind of written myself into a corner with the character. Uh, basically, the whole premise is he's like he's kind of like Brian on Family Guy. He's actually a very intelligent animal, but except Fido is very camera shy and he pretends he's a regular bird when he's on camera. You can only do so much with a character like that, and I'm kind of thinking about losing him in season two. Damn, taking it like a champ, but I haven't re really decided what to do with him yet. So I don't know. Uh, I, I might replace him with another character I kind of thought of, which is based on the uh, Magic Mirror in Snow White. I don't, I don't know. With that character, I can actually talk to and fro, interact with, he said. I've been chatting with a local makeup artist named uh, Haley Dunphy about getting a wig made for this, like like an actual sculpted silicone wig, like uh, like Vincent Price hair, and that would shave off about 40 minutes off of my uh, makeup application time. Because believe it or not, I don't really look like this, and it takes a while to to get from this to this. So that's a, a really big chunk out of my night when I'm trying to do these shows. Okay, down to the bad stuff. I can't post another episode on YouTube until May 19th because of their uh, corrupt copyright system. Uh, I tried to post the, the episode 2, The Beast of Yucca Flats, and I got flagged for the uh, cartoon, the public domain cartoon that I have in the beginning of the episode, because apparently some band uh, sampled the music for one of their albums, and now this company called Made in Italy apparently believes that they now own the rights to that uh, public domain cartoon. And they have a record of just filing the claim and then sitting back for a month while, while your uh, dispute is running. And they, they ignore it and they collect all the revenue off of your video. And then at the end of 30 days, they get to keep the money. So uh, U2's uh, system was deliberately set up to be very corrupt and evil and give uh, copyright claimants all the power and basically punish uploaders and make it as difficult for them as possible. So I can't post any videos longer than 15 minutes until May 19th. So 
Yeah, that's great. So I may have to post episode three, Missile to the Moon, first, and then episode two, Bisa Yucca Flats, later, which is, isn't a big deal, but it's not the order I wanted to show them in. Not that it actually matters, but actually it does matter, because this pisses me off. So so anyway, that's the State of the Union of Night Chills Theater, and I'm hoping to get a lot more content up for you as soon as I can. But, like I said, uh, YouTube has really uh, screwed me. So, as they continue to screw many, many people and have done for the last several years. At their system that encourages unlawful, illegal copyright claims, which are a violation of federal law. But they do it. So, thank you.